was for me was kind of making me feel better. I would drive home and think, well, I do have these things. And they're out there. I just don't have a hold of them yet, but they're out there. So didn't you write yourself a check? I heard yeah. that you did. Is that true? I wrote myself a check for $10 million for acting services rendered. And I gave myself uh, five years. And uh, I dated it Thanksgiving 1995. And I put it in my wallet, and I kept it there, and it deteriorated and deteriorated. Yeah, that's, that's that the thing. You can't hard. just visualize yeah. and then, you know, go eat a sandwich. <laughs> just before Thanksgiving 1995, I found out that I was going to make $10 million on, I think it was Dumb and Dumber. Dumb and Dumber, yeah. yeah. So you visualize yourself like... <laughs> See it and believe it, it is a lot easier to achieve it. So thank you, Jim, for reminding us of that lesson. And it doesn't mean that for every person that writes the $10 million check that that's going to happen for you because so many times people who um, do that process live in the space of wanting and resisting it instead of writing it, visualizing it, seeing it for yourself and then letting it go. Letting it go, but moving in the direction of working toward it. So nothing happens at first. It's over the process of the time and the effort and the energy that you put into a thing that the energy comes out.